Jeez, what's he doing in there? I've been waiting so long. What are you doing in there? Are you playing with your monkey? <laughs> Careful. <gasps> oh my god. Nah, I'm only kidding, as you can see. Thanks for tuning in to the, uh, you know it, the Muscle Russell. And here I am in Thomas Saddam in here in Connecticut. And it was made by the U.S. Army back in the 1950s. And this is, isn't like the ordinary dam that holds back tons and tons of water. This dam is actually a flood prevention dam. And it actually saves a lot of lives and lots of property in this area here in Thomaston. But I'll tell you, them, them soldiers back then had a lot of sense of humor because they planted a lot of these chestnut trees around here. So if you guys are ever in the area, watch out one of these don't fall on your noggin. So with that, let's go check this place out. Come on. I thought I had to go to the other side so you guys could get the gist of how tall up this dam is. Well, this isn't the dam part actually. This is the main spillway that runs through here. But water hasn't really flowed through here in many, many years. But it's definitely here for prevention to, to save homes down river here. I'll tell you, it's one hot one today. Woo! But here's the, here's the main dam. This is the side with the tracks on it. And, and in a few minutes we're going to walk over and check out the other side. But there's definitely one thing I gotta point out here. Right over this way, is look at that old br train bridge right there. I like that. It definitely needs a new paint job. A nice red paint job that would stand out in the background because that is one beautiful background. Look at look at the, the rocks they blasted away just to get the tracks to go through up and through there. And, and right below the bridge, that's the main spillway. So if it, if it did overflow, all the water is gonna gush right down there, down into the Quinnipiac River that flows beyond or past the tree line. But we're gonna try to get some more views of this place. So let's head this way and let's pan around and we'll go check it out, guys. Come on, let's go see, let's go see what this dam has to offer. There she is. That's the main water inlet here for the dam. So. When this, if this, if it was full with water, that's very dangerous down there because it's like it's like a being in a toilet bowl. You'd be flush, suck right down the inlet, right out the other side of the dam, right into the Quinnipiac River. I do have a picture of when this was uh, flooded in with water. Check this out. That is, now that's a sight for sore eyes. Or, what? or that's a sight for blue eyes. Or that's a sight for brown eyes. Whatever eyes you may have, Bro, what are you that's talking a sight about, for man? any eyes. But you know it took them a lot of blood, sweat, and tears to build this place. And as you can see behind me, it says restricted. Keep off the rocks. But check this out. You know me. I'm telling. Now I know why they want you to stay off their rocks. Because when you jump on them, they're moving around. So the Marmy guys didn't really put them together well, but they did put them together strongly. And there's lots of them, because there's tons of tons of rocks here. And it took tons and tons of rocks to build this place. And that's what it looks like from up here. And if you come down this way, you could drive right down this road. And you can look at all these beautiful views here. Actually, since we're on this side of the dam, Let's walk over here and check out the views over here. Come on. Woo! Here's the here's the tracks from this angle. This is this is a pretty long dam. I was gonna walk down there, but there's some restricted signs everywhere, and I saw some forest rangers. There's a forest rangers barracks right right across the way. So here at the Tom and Stun Dam. You can even bring pets. So those that have a dog, there you go. Just make sure you put his poop in the bag and throw it here in the trash. Oh, maybe I can use it too. But that's besides the point. 
Look at the view here. Look at that. See, I like I like the river cutting through the valley there, and you could just imagine this filling up with water. You, that that would be amazing. But it it's just a pre precautionary dam. So if you guys are ever out in Thomaston, Connecticut, this is definitely the place to be. So with that, guys, have a nice day, and I'll see you around.